Hi Libra, welcome back to I and Igma. This is an Igma. Let's do your love message. So this is going to be a general reading. So take what resonates and leave what does not resonate. For personal readings, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email. Or also do white ray-based spells for high school. We have intention charge, high vibrational, A plus plus great quality crystals available. Check out more on my Instagram. Follow my Instagram and do like, share, subscribe, and comment to this channel and this video. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel, guys, if you want to check out more insights in future okay libra sun moon rising or venus signs wow four of ones is a really good card to have in the beginning i feel like yes there's definitely a new relationship a new love opportunity or something good is about to happen in your life and it's a beautiful energy you can see the four of ones is all about like getting together celebrations marriage engagement announcements all of these beautiful things are happening in your life, guys, real soon. I feel there's someone that wants to marry you or you've just gotten married. I feel it feels amazing for you, Libra. All right, what else? The hangman. The three of pentacles. I feel like things have started going a little bitter, okay, a sour. And you want to improve this connection. Whatever it is, I feel you both want to work this connection out. You both are trying to, you know, uh, heal from the past and get back to each other. But there's someone that is coming between you and your person. What is that? Yeah. I feel like your person has issues. This person has issues. Initially, they were all good. Everything happened so fine. And then the third party came in and this person started getting attracted to the third person. I feel like there is an energy that your person does really like you a lot. But they think there's a lot of work over here. Okay. I feel like here they're getting attracted physically to someone else. Okay. They might regret it later on. But right now, this is what they're doing. So there's someone else in the picture that they're attracted to. All right, the seven of wands, the seven of cups. This person is highly confused. They don't know themselves what they're doing. But there's a third party that's attracting them, that's giving them temptation. Or if you are having someone in your life and then there is a third party in your life and you're getting attracted to that person, stop because that person may not be trustworthy. Okay. And the nine of wands and the king of cups. You know what? This person has love for you. Libra, this is weird. This person has love for you. But somehow, they are not doing the right thing. Okay? Something is wrong with this person. For sure. I feel this could be a Capricorn. What is that? Let me see. The star. Someone from their past has come back into their life, I feel. Oh, wow. There's a possibility that if you're in a toxic connection, then there's someone new coming in. But I'm definitely seeing that whoever you're in a toxic connection with, they want to work things out. But right now, they're just getting distracted. They're in the wrong, you know, um, company. I feel your person has fallen in the bad company. And when it's too late, I feel like they will realize what they're regretting. They're going to come right back to you. If this is what is happening in your life, I feel this person is going to come back to you. There is love here. But if you know that it's ended and you have no one, you're not dealing with anyone, then this new person that's coming into your life with a lot of love here. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Cancer is very strongly available here. Aquarius is there. Whatever it is, in the end of the day, you win. Your love will win. Okay, because this person, the one that is coming towards you, I feel like, yes, this person is confused. You know why they're confused? Because there's someone that is tempting them in their energy. Someone is attracting them in their energy. Maybe initially they uh, convince them for a job opportunity. They will provide them the job and then they're asking for favors. I, I think that's the energy that I'm getting. Your person is somewhere stuck and he's getting brainwashed by someone. There is a person that they are not able to, you know... Um, discern they think that uh, the person cares for them they are honest they're nice because they've helped them in so many different things but they're they're hearing everything that they have to say and they're buying into it and now they will recognize they will realize what they've been doing was wrong so this person is in the wrong person's trap 
they will soon realize it. I'm seeing them finally the time has come where they will realize it now. Okay, they will definitely realize it now, eight of wands. And I'm seeing the passion there is, uh, there is some sort of a physical attack. Uh, attachment with this another person that they've gone completely brainwashed by okay i feel like they're not able to discern well because there's a, a strong passion between the two of you but there's not enough love here but here i feel this person is blaming you for certain things maybe you guys fought on something and this person thought that you don't love them or there's nothing like that they were the only one that was making a lot of efforts they might be avoiding your calls let them be because they're going to reach out to you. If you are completely single and there's no one in your life, then know that someone is trying to get rid of a toxic person in their life that they are <clears throat> physically uh, attached with, but there is no love here. But when they find you, when they see you, they will feel like, oh, you're the one that they were looking for. This person is your soulmate, guys. Now, have, however it resonates with you guys, however you want to take it, this one thing is for sure, whoever is in your life right now, if you're single, you have a soulmate coming in. But if you're there's no one in your life right now and you're done with it, then there's a soulmate coming in. But if you're dealing with someone, then this is your soulmate. Okay, let them be where they are because right now they're trying to have a proper understanding about what they're doing, where their life is taking them and what is going on. Libra energy, some of you dealing with a Libra. And then we're having the Knight of Wands and the Page of Pentacles. This person will take time to realize their love for you. Yeah. Or if this is a new person, they are coming towards you with this energy. But when they know that you're the one, they'll they'll be taking a lot of action towards you. I'm seeing there is passion. There will be passion between the two of you. They will be coming towards you. Six of Pentacles. Give it like six weeks time to six days as well. It depends. But I'm definitely seeing this person is about to make an action towards you. And this time you will be happy because now they have realized their passion for you. Now they have realized their feelings for you. Someone else is also there in the picture. I feel maybe you are the one that has third party over here and you're not able to discern. Okay, then let me tell you that the one that you're sexually attracted to is only here for short term stuff. And then we're having the seven of swords. Yes, see, I was telling you seven of swords. There's someone that is playing with your heart. I feel this person is, uh, uh, you believe in this person more than the other person. There are two people in your life for some of you. It feels like the one um, that things have gone a little sour when you started getting attracted to someone else and that someone else is a complete flirt. All right. But if it's not you, I'm seeing that this person is definitely... If there is just one person in your life, then this person is your soulmate and they are getting attracted to the temptations. All right. So this is a test of temptation. This is a test of time for your person. I feel they will realize what they're missing out on. They think they have to have an upper hand. They think that they are the best and, you know, you will, uh, uh, you will let down your control and, you either either ways any which way you're still going to stick around that's what they think i'm definitely seeing they're gonna miss you a lot or someone already is missing you a lot all right this is a lot of like uh missing nostalgia desire to be with you that's the thing i'm seeing six of cups you are the one that they want to be with you are the one they'll realize it real soon Ten of swords and nine of swords. This person will go through a lot of heartbreaks. This person will go through a lot of trauma and depression. I feel that the one that they're right now getting attracted towards, this person is going to ditch them like anything or this person is going to give them major headache. Like they will go through a lot of mental pain and this will bring them back towards you because they'll realize what they're missing out on. So I'm saying yes, they're definitely coming towards you here. And 
and we are having the magician and the queen of cups you guys are going to come back to each other no matter how many temptations come between you guys you're going to come back to each other you guys are meant to be with your soulmate it does not matter you don't have to worry about oh this person will cheat me or not or this is the one for me or not universe will show you when you least expect it universe is going to show you on its own by the way the ones that are sleeping behind are my two dogs spare them okay <laughs> So what I'm seeing over here, Libra, is it's time for you to just relax and not think of a single thing because it is going to roll in such a manner that in the end of the day, who you're going to be with is actually your soulmate. All right. So this this two of cups, queen of cups, king of cups, and then there's so many other wands, energies, there's so much distractions here in your life or your person's life someone is getting distracted but in the end of the day the love wins you guys are going to come to each other i'm seeing the reason mainly is why uh this is happening is because you guys are not able to understand each other you guys are not expressing each other that well and then i'm seeing four of swords you really want to be left alone you really want your alone time so that you can pay attention over your work over your health and i feel like uh this person thinks about you, but they think it's over. They think it's over. They think this is not going to work out. They're dropping this, but they're going to come back around. That's the energy that I'm getting. So over here, the suggestion for you is to just leave it to God, surrender. It is going to happen when you least expect it. Libra. See, between the two people, there is one older person coming in and that person is using your person through their, you know, tactics. I feel they're pretty smart, pretty manipulative. And I feel it could be you, if you're a man watching this, it could be you that has an older person, older female that is attracting you towards them and you're losing your attention towards the per current person you're dating or you're, you were interested in or you are interested in. So the love is definitely there. It's just that third party is taking a lot of attention over here. Okay. Your person needs to re realize what is happening. I am not available. This person is right now not available because they are definitely being trapped in someone else's uh, energy. And they are completely brainwashed blindfolded after some time something will happen that will make them realize oh this is not my person i left my person behind libra gemini aquarius energy oh my gosh there's strong romance between the two of you you guys i feel like good things always take time it's the same happening here with you and your person they are going to come back around no matter what happens things will come back into balance like never before so if this is happening it's because you guys are still not able to trust each other or still in this unbalanced relation so to bring it into balance there is a need for you to go separately have your experiences and then realize what you're losing so i feel they will realize it real soon and they're going to come and ask for forgiveness because what they do is they're going to miss you. They really care for you. They don't realize it now, but they'll realize it real soon. So you, in this situation, the suggestion for you over here, according to the spread, is that to stay flexible. It's okay. If someone wants to leave, let them go. If someone wants to come back, okay, let's see what they have to say. So the more flexible you are with giving space to each other, with understanding each other and trusting that if this person is saying so and so, this might be true. I feel this is going to make this connection a blessing. Okay. You'll be so happy. Be bold and make the first move. Some of you are planning to reach out to this person. If that is so, go for it. You never know how things roll between you guys. But I'm definitely seeing something magical is about to happen in your life. Not just in your love matters. Otherwise, too. Your confidence is the key to this relationship. You really want this connection to work out. You only need to be confident over here. And for that, take good care of your diet, take good care of your body, your health, 
exercising routine is important highly important and taking a good ample rest relaxing relaxation exercises are very good for you you can also get a jade crystal 100% pure best great quality crystal available with hamsa charm in it for evil eye protection and they will be charged with intentions by me if you want to get a jade you can get it from me i feel this is really good for you for now what else whoa whoa whoa, whoa. your family i feel like your family agrees with this person they their family agrees with the few but in the end of the day you guys are going to be be together and build a family together that's the energy that i'm strongly sensing you can deny it but this is what i'm telling you this is strongly sensed guys okay okay claim this read by writing in the comment section i am blessed because this is a beautiful read guys okay so you may have a gemini an aries a leo a sagittarius coming in all right these are the signs that, are, that may be coming in hey let's focus on the all sign messages i know it's your favorite part i'm going to be reading your all signs from aries to pisces towards libra please give me clear messages aries oh my gosh Aries is highly attracted towards you. They've already thought of having a family with you and you will hear from this person before you can even think of. Taurus is still making a decision. It's still not able to decide, but they're interested. Definitely. Gemini is being played by some third party over here. They will realize it real soon within five weeks and they're going to they're gonna come back around. Uh, cancer. Cancer is like they are still in this childlike energy of getting distracted towards temptation. So give them more time. Leo. Leo is stalking, spying. They have trust issues. They are observing you closely. Virgo. Oh, okay. So Virgo doesn't see themselves fit for you. I feel they think that you're way above their league and you can't uh, be happy with them. That's what they think. Libra. I feel like the Libra is always in two minds. Like they are not able to decide or they're not able to understand what they're doing is right or wrong. Sometimes they're this, sometimes they're that. Like sometimes positive, sometimes negative. Sometimes they're blaming themselves. Sometimes they're you. Sometimes they're with you. Sometimes they're with the other person. So in three weeks or three months time, you will know exactly where this connection is going. Scorpio. Scorpio feels unloved, rejected. They're walking away. Sagittarius is definitely doing something behind your back. Or they tr don't trust you. They've been hurt very badly in the past, many, many times. Capricorn. Capricorn has a huge crush, but they won't say it because they really want to get a hint from you or this person just is a little too bossy. Aquarius. Aquarius is, I feel like the Aquarius treats you like you're their son or a daughter or something. They want to be like your father figure or mother figure, which is sometimes controlling or possessive and overwhelming. So that's the energy, but I'm definitely seeing this person is thinking about marriage. Okay, then we are having Pisces. They're so excited to have met you. They are talking about you, the, all the good things about you. They're talking to people. Oh, I met them and they're amazing. The Libra is amazing. Oh, I'm so excited. What's going to happen? So this is a new beginning. So they are in their excitement. All right. Now let's do the charms here. Someone's name is Shipra Rupali. Uh, someone is working in courier business. Someone has a courier business. Bank. Someone was from Iran, Iraq, Pakistan. Panama. Peninsula. Philippines. Rio. 
someone is wearing Roberto Kowali respond or fair just bought something from there some something from Prada someone's from Ohio Rome Russia Egypt India okay so these are certain countries in Canada so other than that guys this definitely love it's hidden right now it's going to come out in the open real soon if someone is like uh, is not being sure let them be they will realize when they come back to you okay so these could be the initials in your person's name or your name or the letters in your names so that's about it libra i hope you've enjoyed this wonderful beautiful read do not forget to subscribe for more insights for more videos so that we continue to make more and like share comment and claim this i'll see you back again bye